So when you first landed the role of Ghost Rider, did your uh, when your friends and family found out, did they tease you about the whole Nicolas Cage stuff before they knew uh, who Robbie Reyes was? Uh, no, you, what did I hear? I heard, uh, you know, there were the really positive ones. They were like, "Dude, you're gonna you're gonna blow it out of the water." Everything else, you know. Uh, some were kind of like, eh, sometimes you resemble Nick Cage. And I was like, well, you know, but m family and friends, they were just like over the moon. You know, they just, they, you know, they, they always want me to win. They want me to do my best. And, and that's all I'm trying to do is just do my best. And um, the, the, the fan base at large was kind of split, you know, right down the middle. A lot of people were really upset. But that's great because you know, if you don't have half the people loving it and half the people hating it, then what's there to talk about, you know? Yeah, for sure. But thankfully... Uh, I only got one question. Is we'll get the ball for people. We can bring it back. We're just going to play with the cast file. Okay. Finish this one quick. Sure. But thankfully, after the show came out, it's been almost like 98%, 99% positive. Everybody's just like, we got the ghost rider that, that we want, which is a dangerous cat who, who finishes a job when it comes to doling out his vengeance. And... Uh, I'm proud to be that guy. Ghost Rider is a pretty badass dude, and he has a pretty badass ride. Yeah. But if he could give the Ghost Rider treatment to any other ride in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, mm. like Cap's motorcycle, an Iron Man suit, mm. Star Lord ship, what would you pick? Mm. In the Marvel Universe, mm -hmm. can't just be like my skateboard. Well, I mean that's pretty cool. That'd too. be kind of cool. No, uh, uh, any other? Uh, Lola, where's Clark? No, I Lola. Heard you. Yeah, let's set Lola on fire. How about that?